You're listening to Breakfast here on Radio Adelaide with Tom Mann and Zoe Canardis. Charity Tunes, mental health awareness fundraiser hits Chateau Apollo for a big night of music this Thursday, December 5th, featuring the lights of OKO, Stray Charlie, The Max Headroom, Choosing Signs and a secret headline band. In an effort to give back a little ahead of the holiday season, all the proceeds are going to Beyond Blue. Organiser of Charity Tunes, Jordan Fouth and the secret headline band join us in the studio now. Welcome join Jordan and the secret headliner band who we can now reveal to be Soda, Ooh. Cameron, Ooh. Jamie, Ooh. Nev and Nick. <laughs> from the band, the whole band. The whole band. We're all here. Uh, <laughs> thanks so much for all of you coming in so early on a Monday morning. Well, thank you for having right. us. I had nothing better to do with my time. <laughs> <laughs> Probably be sleeping. Uh, <laughs> so to begin, uh, Jordan, what compelled you to put together this show? Oh, uh, well, honestly, I just, wanted to, I just wanted to put on a show and go and see it. That's it. And then I thought, hey, might as well use the platform for a bit of good. So... Yeah, donate all the proceeds to to Beyond Blue and hopefully give them a hand during this holiday season. Yeah, and we'll start on a bit of a serious note. Obviously, um, mental health within the music industry, I think, personally, is a bit overlooked, mm. uh, especially within musicians. So um, how do you and the Soda Boys, how do you guys feel mental illness is perceived within the music industry? Mm. Oh, that's a big question. It is. I mean, yeah. that's a big we'll question. Oh, this is early. No, I love these kind of questions. I don't know. I feel like there is this kind of... Um, there is this inclination to be open within, you know, within music because that's often what it's about. It's about sharing your feelings and it's about, um, I mean, that's it. I've got nothing more. To, it, there's so many things it's about, but that's what it is for me. I think that's what it is for Nick. Um, when, we, when we write music, it's about, you know, what's going on inside. But then there is this other side to the music industry, which, you know, there is this, if you want to be successful, you have to grind and you have to work so hard. And I don't think the support networks are necessarily there completely for musicians. And I see that's kind of like changing um, in around the scene. It's probably yeah, it's probably hard to just generalize um, the whole. But for us as a group, like mm. I know that um, like taking mental health days and stuff like that, like we we do things like Cam and I and the boys will stay at Cam's house and stay up until like you know the early hours in the morning preparing like a backing track or something like that or recording something. And we just, you know, say, look, the next day, like, let's just chill out and all take some time to ourselves um, because it can be draining because of the nature of the art. Well, I, I suppose on the flip side of that too, uh, in terms of putting on a charity gig, uh, uh, like, have you guys had feedback on people who've come out and see shows, you know, maybe maybe they're struggling uh, and go, this actually really helped. I, I needed to get out of the house. I needed to, you know, feel feel a community and, and feel a feel a I've, great, I've personally, vibe. I've found that myself. Um, where it's, I've just had, you know, there'd be weeks where it's just, you know, staying in my bedroom and then force myself to get out, go to a gig, and bam, immediately it's 100% happy. Um, it's it's definitely, especially here in Adelaide, where it's so small, the scene is, is so small compared to the East Coast, it, it very much is a close, tight-knit uh, community, um, and, you yeah, you have to communicate and talk with each other and, and just bring more people in and make everyone feel happy and safe and, and wholesome, which is what we're trying to do with this gig. Um, Chateau Apollo is a lovely place. Um, it's very intimate. Uh, it should be, yeah, everyone hopefully should feel, uh, should feel happy and safe and, and comfortable there. And Soda, you're in the studio um, to play us a song today, which we're very thankful for. We are. What we'll song try. are you going to play whilst you're getting set up? What song um, are you going to play? It, What's, tell it's, us about it's our latest single. It's called When the Warden Calls. Um, it's our latest single and we've just released it. And we've just done a, a little show, we, uh, festival thing we put on the weekend at Sugar, How to Navigate Your Breathing. And yeah. That's what we're going to do while Nick's tuning up. I'm just talking. <laughs> nice. Space. So what was the song called? Sorry? When the Warden Calls. Nice. I, I heard this one. I, I like it. He likes it. I like this and song. And that's good. <laughs> uh, you know, it's a, thank you. Thank you, Jordan. Thank you. Well, whenever you're ready, take it away. Last time I pass out Just a tickle of sugar And I got on these side routes Just to feel a little younger Oh, and you gon' tell me, darling, you won't And then we're only you and clothes mm, And when the water goes And the patient start to say 
I'll be here alone Bells rattling in my ears And when the dust settles There are some things I cannot say In my head again Make my bed in heaven I can hold my mind back But I gotta get the door The devil's in the hallway And there's footsteps in all my own Manic dreams of gods in the dead Skew my reality, it's all in my head Ooh. And when the water calls And the patients stop to say And I'll be here alone Rails rattling in my ears And when the dust settles Some things I cannot say in my head again Made my bed in there Get the oh, I'm delirious again Without you all in Fading pictures in my head All these friends I can have Many dreams of gods in the dead Skew my reality, it's all in my head Oh, when we are only human clones So darling, won't you tell me you Stop to sing And I'll be here alone It's rattling in my ears And when the dust settles There are some things Cannot say in my head again Made my bed in there When the water comes Oh, made my bed in there When the water Incredible. That was When the Warden Calls, live in the Radio Adelaide studio by Soda, who are, of course, chatting to us before the charity tunes at Mental Health Awareness Fundraiser this Thursday at Chattapolo. And you were the secret headlining band for this gig. It's How a do secret. you keep it? It's no longer a secret. It's obviously. no longer a secret, is it? How did you keep the secret for so long? What did um, that feel like? Well, there was a big t- piece of tape over our name. Yeah. <laughs> that was, that's, that's how we kept it so well. And we, Adelaide yeah. doesn't have many uh, four-letter yeah. bands. Four-letter bands, yeah. it's kind of... <laughs> yeah. Like, yeah, it's a big secret, but then we still put your name on the poster. Yeah, on the poster. Tape, right? that, that, that was the joke. piece of tape. It's a good idea. I <laughs> thought it was cool. Obviously, along with this, uh, yeah, with you guys as the secret headliner, there's some other great bands. Jordan, can you tell us about oh, yes. the, about the awesome lineup and bands. how you put it together? Um, okay, so, so the lineup consists of, of Soda here, uh, Choosing Sides, uh, The Max Headroom, Stray Charlie and Oko. Um, how did I how did I get them together? Uh, well, choosing sides I've I've been aware of for a while. Um, they had an awesome single launch recently for their song Transmit, which was that, that was awesome. Um, uh, the Max Headroom uh, I've also been aware of for a while. I saw them support Private Function at the Grom House. A uh, number of months ago now. What an awesome venue! House, oh, it? I know. I just went there a couple of weeks ago. That's that place good. is yeah. sick. Um, it's a house. It's, it's a, just a house. It's just yes, yeah, a suburban house. Um, Stray Charlie. Uh, that one's a bit biased because the guitarist is my cousin, so I so I, so I gave him a hand and cleared <laughs> him in there. Um, and then and then opening is Oko, who I have to give a shout out to my friend Mackenzie, who put me onto them. Um, uh, Apparently they haven't played a show in a while, so this will be their first show in a bit, which should be cool. Um, yeah, they seem alright, and that's the lineup. 
<laughs> so, yeah, so it's going to be a pretty special gig. Mm. Uh, yeah, so once again, this Thursday night, Chateau Apollo, all the proceeds are going to Beyond Blue. Uh, yeah, uh, it's going to be a great time. Guys, thank you so much for joining us in studio this morning. No exactly. worries. Thank, thank you us. for having us. <laughs> uh, Jordan Fouth and Soda, all the, all the folks from Soda talking about charity tunes, mental health awareness fundraiser this Thursday at Chateau Apollo. It's going to be a huge night. Incredible name. Tom, are we going to a song or are we going to say goodbye first? Uh, we're going to say goodbye. Okay. That's pretty much all the time we have all left right. on the breakfast can I, program. Can I add a little, add a little thing? Oh, oh, please. Little bit, please. Uh, we've changed the opening times to 7.30. Uh, and we're actually going to have uh, the Mahogany String Quartet opening the gig. Cool. Uh, so just just a little thing in there. Nice. Thank you. Little <laughs> update. Secret opener. Secret opener. <laughs> <laughs> secret opener. Um, yeah, announcing a secret opener. That's cool. We are going to go. Stay tuned for local noise coming up after the news. Three hours of all Australian music. Um, and also don't forget... Our Save Radio Adelaide campaign is still going, so you can head to the Radio Adelaide website, radioadelaide.org.au, and go pledge some money to that. We surpassed 7K this morning, so thank you so much for all your support. We really appreciate it. We'll be back tomorrow. Big thank you to our producer, Zach. This is Workhorse with Peace. Bye.